The death of Steve Blakely's wife has shocked the state, and the burning question is, were his actions deliberate or accidental? Hey, welcome back. Thank you, Richard. Nice to be on the same team at last. Owen Mitchell. Janet King. Sally Blakely was diagnosed a year ago. Esophageal cancer, aggressive. Just after 7 p.m., she started looking in a lot of pain, according to him. And within 10 minutes, he'd given her three injections. Neither of us think a man like Steve Blakely should end up in jail, though, do we? No, but we can't rot the system just to get a particular outcome. Put aside who Blakely is for a moment, and let's relook at the facts and the circumstances. An immediate custodial sentence in the upper range of eight to ten years is the minimum that should be considered. To hell with fair play, to hell with teamwork and natural justice. I don't want her on any of our cases ever again. Well, the kids still love me when they know what I do. Why would you worry about that? Because I want them to grow up learning about tolerance, forgiveness, acceptance. So what do we got? Oh, cars unlocked, keys under the front seat, no obvious blood, no obvious damage to the interior of the car or the boot. Find him dead or alive. I want speed, I want professionalism, I want a result. He left a message. It just says, please forgive me. What are you doing? If I tell you the truth, no one needs to know, do they? Where are you going? I don't have to tell you. I know who did it. I shouldn't be worried, should I? I tread very carefully if I were you. I'm not going anywhere.